hello guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys janet is back as you guys can see how are you guys how are you feeling everybody is doing percy percy she wanna do percy percy i'm okay too i'm okay and i'm happy now that i'm back and i pray that um, nothing will take me away longer again from you guys and those of you that you keep watching my video thank you so much and i thank you to uh you my new subscriber thank you so much you guys you know you know your genius now i'm trying to show off with this hair how can i show off with the hair you know what i mean <laughs> hair now beauty of woman yeah the beauty of the woman i mean like hair is beauty of woman what do you guys think so how are you guys how have you been thank you to my new subscriber and thank you to you my old subscribers that subscribe to my recipe my daily life and those of you that watch my daily life me asking me janet when are you gonna do daily life i mean we are missing it we are missing it thank you guys now i'm back that's why i post one video earlier this morning right guys yeah because i'm going to make sure i post this video today later in the day and um you know you guys don't mind me i was just playing around being silly you know like i'm back but i was back I mean i am back right i'll just say the english again hmm. anytime i go few days i'm always like how do you speak the english again because you guys you know the more i'm speaking the english with you guys like almost every day the more i'm learning with my kids and everything but don't worry guys i'm working on that okay so as you guys know by the title celebration time to celebrate <laughs> time to celebrate guys can you see before we start the topic what am i celebrating for jenny seriously what's happening are you pregnant oh you guys if i'm pregnant do you think i'll be drinking this kind of drink and those of you ask me in one of my video you are so com confused so how do you say the word you are so convinced that i was pregnant right to tell you guys i'm not pregnant i'm just opening it yeah I don't think I can open this up. Ah! Sorry, guys. Let me get up and open it. Ah! 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 <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, baby. That's the spirit. So now I'm going to pour. Cheers <laughs> to those moms out there that today is your freedom. <laughs> today is your freedom. Those mom out there, cheese. Yeah, can you guys see? Let me do that again. This mom out there, today is your free day. Shout out to you all. All the moms in the house. Um ooh. Mm. Can you guys see me properly? Okay. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now let's start talking. Why am I celebrating? What is the problem? What is happening? Okay, um, what was happening today? I mean, what happened today was throughout this week, my son after that reception, you know, from nine to twelve, from uh, nine to one thirty. So today is the day he started from nine to three thirty. Th around 3 30 3 20 30 and i'm so happy because i couldn't wait for this day to come like how many of you out there that you have kids like it's just, like your last born yeah because i believe my son is my last born okay guys no more babies i'm done i don't want to see myself in that labor room again i'm sorry i have three kids already hmm and those of you that you are new, okay, uh, my name is Janet Obeji. I'm a mother of three, and my channel is about a lot of things, you know, whatever you subscribe to is like that, it's also like topic like this, to encourage other moms as well, because I'm a mom, I'm a mother of three, married, not single, married, 
So, um, how many of you out there that your last born, you couldn't wait because you have other kids that they are old, they can go to school themselves, they can do things, but your last born is the one, you know, you want to do things, you have to be looking for nanny to look after her or him, you can't really do much because of that. How many of you? I'm one of them. So, I couldn't wait for my son to start school, you know, full-time school, because even though when he was going to a nursery, you know, it's just three hours a, a week. I mean, not a week, three hours a day, you know. So before you pick him, before you drop him, and you pick him, you know, before you drop him, it's time again to pick him. So it's not like, so I was looking for this day. It's a long time I was hoping that, ah, God, if this day come, ah, I can't wait, cannot wait, cannot wait, cannot wait. And I, I was able to wait, and the day come, and my son has been to nursery, eh, not nursery. I'm talking so fast, guys, because I'm always, I'm, I'm, I'm excited, I'm excited, I'm excited, you know. So today is the day that my son starts reception full time from today on. That's why I'm celebrating that. Like I have freedom. I can do things without worrying. I'm a worry free now when it comes to babysitter or babysitting. You know what I mean? Or when it comes to nanny, I'm free of that. I don't worry about that anymore by the time I want to do things. Because there are sometimes I want to do things that... You know, I need nanny to pick my son up from nursery. You know, I need nanny to stay with my son and all that. But I know now that my schedule, of course, from 9 to 3.30, hello. And there's even after school club. So if I'm running late, I can just tell my children to go to after school club. And my first daughter, I've started secondary school. And that video, I'll make it a separate video for that. Because there's so many details that I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. So now I want to um, give you guys advice, things that I didn't know before my daughter starts secondary school. I would like to share with you guys with my own experience, which is kind of a bit, you know, like, oh my God, I didn't know. Nobody tell me. And, you know, so I'm going to make a separate video on that so that those of you that you have children that have not started secondary school, you can know now. You can know now. You don't wait till the last minute like me. Last minute, I know all these things, you know. But I'm here to say I'm very happy, you know, my son, I've started a school full time. Mm, um, my, you know, how do you say the word? Yeah, my, I'm just so happy, like, I don't need nanny anymore. Well, I won't say not anymore, you know, but rare. I have Adley, because there are a lot of things I want to do during the day, but I couldn't because you know, my son is around, I can't go to a place, maybe there's a place I'm supposed to go, I'm not going to take children, children is not allowed, I have to start looking for nanny, you know, there, sometimes there's no nanny, you just have to cancel important meeting and all that, all that is, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm free from that now. <laughs> it's windy, you guys do notice, if you live in UK, you know that, you know, this time around, this wind is just everywhere, so my upstairs door is kind of closing, that's why I look like... Who is coming to get me? I don't get your love fries, so you know what I mean, guys. So that is what is going on. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. And those of you that you are a young mom, don't worry, the time will come. You to pass, so it will pass it because once I was like that, have little children, <clears throat> I have two year old, I have newborn baby couldn't wait for my children to grow up, you know, blah, blah, blah. but I kind of like, when I look at their baby pictures now, I'm like, oh, I want my children to stay this baby, you know, because they were so cute, I want them to like, kill like this forever, but I know that that time that they were that cute, they were just toddler or baby, I couldn't wait for them to grow up, you know, you know, so that there are some things that, I mean, we can never finish learning parenting, the more you have the, the the more um your children are growing the more you are learning new skill nobody i've not seen anybody that will come and if anybody tell you guys that oh i'm the best mom because i know all no parents know all i tell you guys my first daughter she's 11 from 11 years i've been a mom there are some things i don't know and there are some things that i'm just learning and there are some things i've not known yet that i know i'm still going to learn in future you know excuse me Because when you have these children, okay, first thing, you want to get married, 
I'm gonna start having babies or most of you you just want to you just want baby even though you are not married one baby with your maybe your boyfriend or your fiance or your partner whatever not knowing that there are lots of res uh, responsibility that you, you you might not know or you just want baby you don't want you want to know the other consequences or, or anything you just want baby i was lucky i was married before i have my children and even then you know when my my when i had my baby i couldn't wait for my baby to grow up to stop using pampas because it's a headache for me to be buying pampas every week i couldn't wait i couldn't wait for my baby to stop uh, a formula like milk you know bottle milk although i even though i breastfeed but i couldn't wait for my child to you know stop drinking milk so that i'll stop buying milk and when my child stopped drinking milk i have to buy those organic pudding and one is one pound if you are lucky they will sell um maybe 10 for you for six pound 50. sometimes they do that kind of sales or sometimes when you are lucky some shop will sell it for 90p and you know how many my child will drink a day you know maybe like five or six you know you know so i can't wait for my child to stop eating other kind of thing because you know those things cost more money and when you make maybe like your own made homemade they might not like it so those kind of things cost money and you can't wait for them to stop eating all that so that you know you know the less money you'll spend but you don't know that the more they are one thing is you are passing one thing another thing is waiting for you do you understand that is how it is so you can never say now like i'm happy now that my son have started full-time school but there are other challenges waiting for me already that i know <laughs> you know what i mean guys we can never win we can never know all we can never know you know sometimes i ask my children that you guys am i the best mom in the world they were like hmm sometimes i'm like seriously i thought i'm the best mom in the world so when you when you're when your children come to you and say mommy do you know you are the best mom in the world not that in their mind they know that okay you might be the best mom but sometimes you're not the best and you know why they'll say sometimes you're not the best maybe sometimes they, they have a party and you're too tired to take them they'll say that that if you are the best mom you should be able to take them to that party whether you are tired or you are not tired maybe sometimes they want chocolate and you think that ah, chocolate okay ah, ah. or maybe you buy something and they just eat it and we're like you can't be eating this food like this. That is an abuse. Food abuse. That is waste. Ojuko <laughs> koro. They'll be like, you are not the best mom. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's not like they'll be telling you when you don't buy it, but sometimes they'll come to you and say you are the best mom. You know, sometimes they'll tell you, you sometimes you are the best mom, but sometimes you are not. Because my children have told me that before several times. And you know, in this country, children they don't hide their feelings. <laughs> Not like us that we are <laughs> not like us that we're brought up in Africa that we are scared. Even now, there are some things that I cannot like face my mom and tell my mom because the kind of fear, you know, the way you are brought up that don't talk like this to your elderly. You cannot say this. You know that fear is still there. There are something that my children they are so confident. They tell me as if uh -huh, so. Uh -huh. I'm just saying it as it's happening, you know, I'm just saying it because it's true. There are some things that I cannot tell my mom like that because I have that. It's not like my mom will beat me or shout at me or something like that. But I'm kind of, I have that fear. They know that fear that they used to brought us up, you know. So these children, they'll just tell you how things are, you know what I mean. So, mm, that is it. But what I'm here to tell you guys now, the main key is that the more... The ch these children are growing the more they are growing the more expenses you'll be spending i didn't even know i thought oh the more my children are growing the more less expenses no i didn't know i did not know i just <laughs> when my daughter enters secondary school that is when i know that when your child is growing the more expenses and i'm kind of worried because i speak to few moms and you know their own opinion which i'm going to make separate video because if i said i'm going to make that video i'm gonna say that topic in this video maybe 24 hours i'm still here i want to like you know say you might help other moms as well you might start have idea now before your 
you know, before your daughter or your son starts school, you know what I mean? But I'm just so happy. You know, guys, I'm so happy. Like, oh my God, I can't believe I'm free. I have freedom. Oh my days. Oh my days. You know, sometimes I want to do video. My son be running around everywhere. Maybe try to watch our own, his own store making i'm like oh lada you're making video make it slow you know like that now nothing nothing it just means the house you know what i mean i'll be able to like make more video do more recipe do more daily life you know just to tell you guys and this video um the video i'm planning to be doing more now is about just daily life how because when i started this channel i say it's about busy moms which is still busy mom but you know, I'm just, I was just sharing my cooking and all that, but now they're going to be everything involved now, but I'm trying to look for money now to get a laptop and a good camera. If you guys know what I mean? Yeah. So I want to be doing like daily life. How, how you, 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 you like if you're a mom, a mom of three or mom of four, five, seven, you know, as many kids you want, but and that reminds me i also have you those of you shout out to you guys that those of you that you have four kids you have five a friend or one of my friends i won't say my friend my friend but it's like kind of a, my colleagues he has um five kids bless him and anytime i'm like worried like oh my god you know this is so expensive you know before you buy food is finished especially when they're on half term and the more these kids are growing the more food they eat i'm like should people that have five four seven they try like shout out to them i have three i'm only complaining and i know some of my friends that have two and they complain i'm like how about me that have three you know people that have four they'll be like how about we that we have four people that have five like, how about we that we have five you know what i mean so the only parent that you know that will not complain is when you have one child you will not complain maybe you might complain about the pain because i also have a friend that have one child and she was like i don't want any more baby because of the pain uh before she said before she had baby she was like she wanted to have five but now she had one she's gonna stop on that one mm -hmm. and it's okay by her husband i'm like okay whatever i did not see myself having one kid or two i see myself having three so even when i have those my two girls i always see that there's a gap i don't know what i happen to you guys when you plan like children i just see that gap every day when when i see my daughter's picture i'm like there's a gap there i need to fill that gap because i have it in mind that i want three kids you know and now the gap is complete so no more babies those of you that you think i'm pregnant i'm not pregnant let me show you guys my tummy can you guys see if i'm pregnant this one now now fat you know what i mean because my tummy used to be big if you guys know in my video that my tummy was big thanks to um juice plus that make it go so it's not like i'm pregnant i'm not pregnant i'm okay i shout out to one of my uh youtuber friend her name is love matters love matters she just had a baby girl oh my god that baby is so cute oh my days when she was um she uh, shared the video with us and uh, like to for us to see the baby oh my days my daughter was like oh mommy i wish she live in england here so that we can go and visit that the baby is so cute thank you for sharing that video and um well done you know you have two boys one girl i can't imagine how you spoil that baby you know what i mean i was telling my daughter that ah love matter is you know just you know spoil this baby with dress the dress pink pink you know pam, pam. because we boys boys are so boring with their dressing you know just trust that trust that when i had my son because i have two girls first when i had my son i was like okay i didn't buy much i'm just buying trust that trust that trust that but when i had my girls oh my god you see this dress you see this skirt this short flower purple pink this that you want to buy even though you know that that your child your baby does not need it you still want to buy it because they look so cute i can't imagine someone that have two boys and now have girl i can't imagine i can't imagine the expense all the clothes sister love matter just you know and you want, if you want to buy don't buy if your if your daughter is i'm sure you're a mom you know this but i'm still gonna say for other mom that might help if your daughter or your baby is six months don't buy um don't buy six to nine months buy nine to twelve yeah nine to twelve if your daughter is six months buy nine to twelve yeah so that at least you always have nine to eleven if you have three months you know though because when you buy these babies they grow quickly before you know it's small for them and then you know and then my son started saying mommy i want a baby 
I want a baby sister. I'm like, seriously? <laughs> okay, well, I don't do my own. The pray where they pray now, you finish your studies, get a good job, get a good career, you know, little job, big paid, get your wife, good wife, and then you can start having your own baby. I don't do my own. What do you guys think? So I'm gonna leave this video. It's 20 minutes already. I don't want to do any more. So that is what I'm just here to tell you guys. Shout out to me and shout out to all the moms out there that your son or your daughter start, um, you know, uh, full time school. I like your last baby, your last baby start. And those of you that your first child start to congratulations, well done to you guys. And those of you that you are still young mom, you know, enjoy it now. Enjoy watching your baby while your baby is so cute. Yeah, yeah. Like anywhere you put your baby, your baby will stay there. Whatever you wear for your baby, your baby will wear it. Enjoy that moment now because I tell you, there'll be a time that you buy this. They're like, oh, mommy, what is this? <laughs> Excuse me. Mommy, I want to go shopping with you. I want to choose my own clothes. You cook this. Oh, mommy, I don't want this. This is what I want to eat. You know, there'll be all time. That time will come, you know. So you guys that you have newborn baby, enjoy it now. You get those of you that you are still pregnant, enjoy your pregnancy. Enjoy it because when I, ha when I was pregnant with my son, I enjoyed it because I knew it was my last pregnancy. So I enjoy it. There'll be more video for that and there'll be more recipe coming. Thank you guys for your support and your love. Thank you so much. I'm going to leave you guys. I'll be back. See you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye. Come and join me. Mm. Before I go, before you guys start saying, oh, Janet is a drunk car, she likes drinking. Can you guys see? Mm -hmm. It's grape juice, okay? Even my children drink it too. Okay, guys? So it's not, <laughs> it's not alcoholic. It's not alcoholic. Okay, what me? Okay, I'll see you guys. Bye. Love you guys. See you. <laughs> <laughs>